We are here on Chalky Mount on a beautiful day as you can see enjoying an extreme endurance hike. This hike involves four hills. As you can see I'm panning around now to show you the sort of territory in which we are hiking. And uh, we are going up there. We are going higher up so we haven't yet reached the top. Over there we have some interesting rock formations. And over there is the chalky mount. Often referred to as the sleeping giant. You should be able to see the eye sockets, the nose and the mouth, the chin. For a long time it's been that way. And I guess it will be hundreds of years before it uh, changes the history that you can't recognize it. So, down below they keep the cows on the pasture. I don't know if I can get close enough. Ah, yes. Now you can see that house in the bushes over there. That is the squatter fella who keeps the, house, the cows. Let me zoom in for you. Right down there in the valley. And in a matter of fact, as you can see, he's in style. He has a solo water heater on top of the house. So he's not even suffering for hot water. The wind is very uh, strong up here, so I hope we don't get seasick. Just looking at that long picture. But he lives in relative isolation down there, as you can see. And we're not sure whether he's a squatter or whether the land might be his. We would like to. So we're about now to continue the hike. Okay, since uh, Hurricane Thomas and the rainy season of 2010, all of our trails are overgrown with bush. As you can see, this area used to be a cleared track before, but this one is not used anymore. Over here now, is my two hikers for today. Yes, thank you, that's good. John and Jeff. And as you can see, behind them, we have basically come through the middle of nowhere. And there's a lot of thorny bushes. I wish I could, oh yes, here is one I can zoom up on to show you the kind of thorns that we've had to deal with on this hike. Let me zoom in on these thorns for you. As you can see, they are long, and if they catch your flesh, you will know that you have been stuck. So far, we have just got scratched, but not seriously stuck. And the bushes are more or less taken over the entire valley. Anyhow, we shall survive. So, see you soon again. What we're looking at here now is basically a wild flower. I've never seen one quite like this before and I'm hoping that I will get a nice picture here okay now you see it there again and um, if the first exposure wasn't right hopefully this one will be so we're going to Cut it here and just take a Right, we're here in the plain now, heading towards Bruceville River. And uh, this is what it's like to come on a extreme endurance hike. A giant tree felled by Hurricane Thomas was blocking our trail. And it may not look as impressive in the picture as it really is in real life. But we had to make our way through it but that did not daunt my intrepid explorers at all I think many other people would have been phased by that but no grumbling from these two serious hiking is what it's about with these two you may be hearing about them later on <laughs> 